Hi, this is Keith Baggy. Welcome to tvlesson.com. This is section 2.1 of Excel spreadsheet for 2007, and we were going to be talking about how do I open an existing worksheet, and it's very simple. What you do is first you bring up Excel, and where you go to Office, click on Excel, and you, you can see that things are different looking in version 2007. We are going to talk about that in other lessons. But in order to open up an existing worksheet, you can click on the Microsoft button, the Office button, and you go down. In this case, I want to say Open. And you can pick and choose what folders and what directories that you want to go to. So in this case, uh, on my desktop, I have a folder called Spreadsheets. And you'll notice here that they have three files. And one of them has the default attribute for the new form of the spreadsheets, which instead of .xls, like it was in the older versions, it is now dot Excel SX. So I'm going to double click on that. And you see, you bring up the worksheet, and notice at the top here, it has the name of the file. And I wanted to point this out because if we were to do, if we were to bring up an older file, let's say, an older version. One nice thing about Excel 2007 is that it's backwards compatible, meaning that you can still handle the older versions of spreadsheets. So we currently have this one open right now, Excel SX. I'm going to open the older version from uh, Excel 2003. Double click on that. And let's expand this up a little bit. Use the magnifier down here same spreadsheet, and you'll notice that the name is the same with a different attribute at the end, but it states that it is now in compatibility mode. And the reason for this is that in order to work with your older documents, that Excel will bring the documents in so you can work on it, but in order to do that, it has to shut off some of the advanced functions. It will not work with the older format. So you'll find certain areas on your ribbon that are grayed out that you will not be able to do with when you're working in, in compatibility mode. Now, the other thing I wanted to point out in compatibility mode is that it is automatic. You cannot manually turn it on or off. So if you have an older version, it comes up in compatibility mode, you're pretty much stuck with that. Uh, what you can do to get around that is you can just copy the contents and open up a, a new document and then paste it in there, and that way it'll be in the new format. So anyway, that is how you open up an, uh, an existing worksheet. And the next session we'll be talking about is 2.2, which is moving around inside the ribbon interface.